tonight I'm here at the wonderful Center for Irish Music, Celtic Junction, to hear uh, Tom Dayhill's band. Tom Dayhill has been around the Minnesota Irish music scene forever. You might hear him playing in the background here. Um, just a great set of music. They're trying to work their way to the Irish dance band competition in Ireland. So, you know, traditional music is still alive right here in my hometown of St. Paul, Minnesota, especially Irish music. off with a historical recreation of Pid's Eye Parent, the French-Canadian who is the first European inhabitant of what is now St. Paul, Minnesota. Pid's Eye, by all accounts, was an eccentric fur trapper and bootlegger who ran a very successful operation. The town was named Pid's Eye for a while until a more Puritan faction had their way. the Irish were one of the first non-indigenous settlers in the region around St. Paul, Minnesota. Their early frontier lumberjack exploits in the upper Midwest are fairly well documented if you know where to look. The Celtic Junction was opened in 2009 to serve the unbroken tradition of Irish music fans in Minnesota. It is a fine venue to see the music away from the living rooms and the pubs. World-class Irish musicians make their home here, and one might say the music and the culture is thriving. Tom Dayhill still cheerfully plays his part in this continuing tradition. Mm -hmm. 